We have the EGC 110-112i family, Jung Heinrich brings a completely newly developed range of pedestrian stackers to the entry-level segment. Thanks to the integrated lithium-ion battery, the design has been completely revised. A new chassis, new mass profiles and reinforced support legs are offering more stability and residual lifting capacity. This is immediately noticeable when picking up a load with our test truck, the EGC 112i. The maximum of 1200 kg go easily to 2 meters 90. At a maximum lifting height of 4 meters 70, still 650 kg load capacity remains. The Stacker EGC 112i is available in sizes S and XS, which differ mainly in their L2 dimensions. For all trucks in this series, the chassis height is also considerably lower. This offers more visible fork compared to the former model. All trucks in this EGC 110-112i family come with a built-in 230V lithium-ion battery charger from 15 up to 70 amps capacity. So intermediate charge at a normal power socket is always possible. The performance of the new stacker family are impressive. We measure scores well above average in this class. Compared to the EGC 110 from our 2017 test, lifting speed has almost doubled. On our standard stacker test track, we drive the new truck on all three available programs and with and without curve control. Conclusion, at the max mode we get 20.5% higher performance than the class average. Without curve control we gain another 3%. Looking at energy consumption, the newcomer is less efficient than average. This is no problem, for this entry-level stacker is not primarily chosen for constant working over 5 hours or more. Conclusion: With the new EGC 110-112i series, Jung Heinrich brings to the market a remarkably compact range of stackers with improved performance. The trucks have a very good stability and operate pleasantly and predictably. We recommend an activated soft landing and, if possible, a different type of gearings in the drive unit. At higher masts, like the 4.70 m of our test truck, you feel that the truck moves back and forth a bit on the drive unit when lowering a heavy load. Jung Heinrich is considering whether to make a slightly more expensive diagonal gearing optional for customers with high masts and heavy loads.